Hey everyone, Technomancer here with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to screen mirror your iPhone to your Mac in the simple and the easiest way to do it. So let's get started. So if you have a MacBook and the iPhone, this is the first thing you want to do is connect it using the charge cable, just like the way you charge your iPhone here. You'll take that cable and then plug it into your USB uh, C cable port that's on the side here, just like that. And once you plug it in, it might ask you to um, install a software. You don't need to do this, uh, but if you're old, you should update it. But then you're going to wait for it to see if there's a trust message that comes up. It might pop up if it's the first time you're connecting. You're going to click on trust. And once you do that, you're going to go over to your search bar here and basically search for the QuickTime app, which is this app right here. You can search QuickTime Player. Once you have opened up the app, we're going to go ahead and open it up. It's not going to really open up. It's going to look like this. What you need to do here from it is go over to the top here where it says file and then we're going to do a new movie recording. We're not going to actually record a movie but this is the option you want to select and it's going to open up this page to go ahead and record a movie but we don't need to do that. All we're going to do is click on that little arrow that's pointing downwards right here and then select our camera to be instead of using that one we're going to use our iPhone a camera or select the name of your iPhone that's listed here and once you select that as you see here we're not going to install software it will now allow me to screen mirror just like that so whatever I do on my iPhone I can actually record this here and even or just screen mirror it without even recording and then that's how you can do it and also expand this a little bit further so that you have a nice screen mirror from your iPhone to your uh, MacBook just like that. So that's how you do it. I hope this quick video was helpful. So please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks like this one. See you guys next time.